This is Chris 6 News at Noon. Well, good afternoon and thanks for joining us. After just two days of testimony, the Elton Holmes case will soon be going to the jury. In fact, closing arguments just ended minutes ago in his trial. He's the man accused of running over two King High School students last March. 15-year-old Madison Knott survived, but 16-year-old Rayanne Garza died from her injuries. Holmes faces several charges, including manslaughter and two felony counts of causing an accident involving a death. And again, if he's found guilty, Holmes faces up to 99 years in prison.